I greet you, my brothers and sisters, in the mighty name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I trust uh, this uh, video message finds you well uh, and in good spirits by the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. I come before you to update you about our internet TV channel or service. Uh, last year we conducted a fundraising in order for us to be able to pay the, the huge bill uh, which needs to be covered for us to be able to broadcast 24 hours a day, 24-7 uh, throughout the year uh, without any disruption. Uh, and we were able to raise the money that was needed for last year. And the purse went to my call last year for assistance from ministry partners and ministry followers. We also got a, a, a pledge from uh, Christians of goodwill, a certain family uh, here in Southern Africa. They pledged to raise money for the subscription this year. And the truth to their word, they started to make contributions. But uh, unknown to us, uh, they were making contributions to a wrong account, an account which is not uh, under our control. So <clears throat> we discovered it around February when a senior member of our secretariat made an inquiry uh, th through the phone with the family that gave us that pledge. Uh, it is covered that uh, there are several installments that uh, they've been making to, to this wrong account. And when we made a follow-up to find uh, out whether the transactions could be reversed, because we wanted the transactions to be reversed so that the money could be relate to the proper account of the minister. We, the owner discovered that his account had gone dormant because he had not been using it for quite some time. So he started a process around February of trying to revive his account because he was told that the bank cannot reverse transactions in a moribund or in a dormant account. The account has to be first of all revived. For it to be revived, they needed to carry out their actual diligence as a bank. So they required quite a bit of paperwork. And uh, they referred the owner of the account to different offices w within the banking group. So he's been fulfilling the um, requirements of the bank. They told him that uh, they will be communicating with him via email. So over the past two months, we've been waiting for his, uh, the account to be revived. But we are realizing that time is running out because uh, we are required to renew our subscription for the internet uh, television service by the 1st of May. And today is the 25th of April. So that's why I'm coming before you. I'm coming to you our partners and followers of Divine Kingdom Baptist Ministries uh, and Divine Kingdom TV Ministry to say we need your urgent and the help because we don't know when we will be able to get those funds for us to be able to, to pay for the invoice. So that's why we are coming to you, to whoever has got a willing heart uh, and whoever is a man or a woman of goodwill to assist us by whatever contributions you are able to relate to the ministry, you help us to raise the amount of 4,788 so that we are able to settle the payment by the 1st of May. Uh, this internet TV service is assisting a lot of people in countries where access to YouTube and Facebook is quite limited. And it's assisting a lot of people who, who need uh, television programming, not necessarily the playing of videos on demand, as is the case 
uh, on YouTube where you have to look for the videos. Or on the internet TV at any given time, they, there will be a message, a prophecy, a word of encouragement, a teaching, or a message of exhortation or ministration which will be playing 24-7. Some saints, they want programming which is like that. And they've been assisted a lot by the messages that they've been accessing from the ministry via the internet TV channel or the internet TV service. So that's why we are coming to you because we realize that there is a risk that uh, come first of May we may not be able to pay for, for the channel and uh, uh, all, all the programming will be just uh, stopped. And we don't know if we are not able to renew uh, the internet TV service, whether our videos which are uploaded and mounted on that platform, whether they will still be there uh, by the time we get the monies which are held up in the account which is still dormant. So that's why we are coming to you with this special request for assistance for us to raise an invoice amount of 4,788. So those with a willing heart, you can relay whatever contributions you have via PayPal. Those who have got access to pay the PayPal uh, money sending and payment platform, or those who are able to contribute via Mkuru, uh, or via World Remit, or via uh, Manikram, you can contribute according to the information which is appearing on your screen. And those who are able to contribute via Penguai, you can also contribute according to the information which is appearing on your screen. So that we relay this money to the company which is pro providing us the internet TV service, which is a Bulgarian company. So may God bless you. I will now say a prayer of blessing to those who have been assisting us and who will give this special contribution. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray for the saints who, who have heard this plea, who will part with their head, heart and money in order to help us pay for this invoice of 4,788. May you touch them, may you touch their finances May you protect their sources of income, their channels of income, their businesses. May you protect their families from sicknesses or any other method that Satan uh, usually uses in order to steal income or to hurt income. In the mighty name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen.